What's up, Internet World? Matthew here with a special end of the year treat for you all. I put together a little highlight reel featuring three of my less than camera shy clients. And if you follow the Instagram, some of the clips that you're about to see are going to look familiar because I've put them up there before. But I figured I'd do this total compilation video for a number of reasons. Chief among them really is to give a big shout out and salute to my clients who are very, very hardworking, very dedicated, uh, some of whom have shown incredible improvement over the past year, uh, whether I saw them for nine months or six months or even in some cases three or four months. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't get everyone to agree to be recorded. Hopefully once they see this video, maybe some people might get an idea, say, hey, I'd like to be featured in 2018. We'll see. Uh, no pressure, but I just I want to give a big thank you and salute to everybody that I've been working with. Uh, you're all amazing. Uh, without you, without my clients, uh, being a Plies instructor would just be another job. And honestly, who the hell wants that, right? So I just want to thank everybody for all the hard work. All right, so moving right along. The first pair of clips I'm going to show you is of two different ladies doing the same uh, move. It's going to be a, an isometric abdominal hold with spinal flexion on the short box on top of the reformer. Uh, we start off with the youngest client I've ever had. Uh, little Samantha is, uh, has been coming to me since about August. At all of six years old, her incredible and dedicated mother brought her in to help her recover from an injury. But within a very short time, uh, it was very apparent that Pilates was helping her with her dance and her martial arts skills. So she's been coming like clockwork ever since. And we'll give a big shout out to Samantha and her mom and dad. Um, she's doing incredible. And I'm sure you'll agree. And then r immediately following her is Eileen. She is, she, she defines grace. And uh, you're going to see how these ladies actually engage their entire body to do this move. So hopefully uh, catch all the subtlety here, all right? So without further ado, show them how it's done, girls. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pinch it over. There you go. Outstanding. Hinge back. Good, and hold there. Good. 14, 13, 12, good, great engagement, very good, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, up and over, yeah, excellent. Now, did you catch the subtlety? Did you see the extra lift in the torso as they rolled their bodies forward without arching the back? Flawless. All right, in this next clip, I'm teaching Sam to engage her iliopsoas, which is the deepest uh, muscle in the body, the deepest deep core muscle in the body. Uh, but she's also uh, using this move in conjunction with her quadriceps. Uh, so keep in mind, this is only the second or third time we had done that move, and it's still considered an advanced exercise. Not because the movement itself is complicated, but because it takes a lot of awareness to do it properly. But of course, Samantha pulls it off with flying colors. Sam? Tune this out. Good. Tune this out. Now pull in, pull up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Less back. Right through here, honey. Right through here. Ready? Let's go. Pull it up. Pull up that leg. There you go. Good. Now hold it. Hold it. Breathe nice and slow and steady. Good. Good. That shaking is good. That means it's working. Okay. Tune out more of the hip. Good, now pull more through that soft spot. There you go, good, right there, yes, perfect, hold it. <sighs> Amazing. Now, I should mention that if I were to have her isolate the iliopsoas muscle and only use that, you really wouldn't see the leg come up, except by maybe half an inch or so. But because I had her start the movement with the iliopsoas and then bring in the more superficial muscles of the hip and legs, you got to see a more dramatic movement. Uh, now, in the next couple of clips, we're gonna see the core limb engagement from the other side. Whereas in the last one, you just saw Samantha use her core and her legs. Next, we're gonna have Eileen on the Cadillac doing a vertical arm press. So she's gonna be involving the core and the arms. Uh, immediately follow that, Samantha's gonna be doing an open arm pec fly on the, on the reformer, again, using the same principles. All right, check it out. 
All right, head up first. Inhale, exhale, push up. Good, hold. All right, curve that lower back in even more. Good, roll down and stop. Good, good, roll down some more. Keep that belly drawn in and stop right there. Good, lower down a little bit more and down. Very nice. Okay, one more right here, right where my finger is. Ready? Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze through the finger. There you go. Much better. Great. Next, I'm going to let Eileen show you what it looks like when you involve the upper and lower limbs together with the core all together in one fluid motion. All right, now pay careful attention to her abdominals themselves. That's where you're actually going to see her constantly make adjustments to her own form. And I'm, you're going to hear me constantly reinforce that, as that is the primary focus, especially when doing these deep core abdominal moves. All right, check it out. Good. Inhale, open. Keep that stomach engaged. Oh, yes. Hope everybody at home saw that, because that was awesome. And exhale, squeeze. Good. Inhale, in. Exhale, squeeze, watch those abs, pull them in tight. Yes, you see that? You see that? Now that's impressive. Speaking of which, the third lady I have for you today is Mary, and she is extremely strong and extremely precise. Uh, in this next clip, you're gonna see her engaging her obliques, along with the muscles of the shoulder and back, and you'll see what it looks like to properly anchor your body to, well, to itself. Uh, and then right after that, we're going to have Eileen showing, the, showing you this, basically the same motion, the same sets of muscles, just going in the opposite direction. All right? Check that out. All right. Exhale. Look at that. Hardly any shift whatsoever. Yes. Lift. Make sure you're lifting high. Good. Yes. Right there. And breathe it out. Um, and go. Nice, really strong. Very good form. Nice. Outstanding. Now, this next clip is one of my absolute favorites. Uh, Mary here is going to demonstrate amazing control as she isometrically isolates her arms and her legs and focuses almost entirely on the obliques. Check this out. And exhale, good. Keep that scooped in. Good. Damn, girl, look at those lines. Good, that is awesome. Two. Okay, last one. Did you see that? Did you see how she was able to direct the energy in the ropes in through her right arm, keeping the force bound by her belly button. See, if you don't do that, then this move tends to turn into a shoulder and arm exercise, and that's not what we're aiming for. We're aiming for the deep core, for the obliques, and she carried that out perfectly. All right, the next two clips are of Samantha and Eileen on the jump boards. Now, this move is a ton of fun, in a, especially in a class that's everybody's favorites, but it requires a lot of coordination and a little bit of trust in yourself and your body to do it without constantly banging on the machine. And in these clips, you're going to see both of them actually hit a couple of times and make adjustments and smooth out the motions. So the self-correction in these next two clips is, is beautiful. And uh, of course, to increase the tone in the deep core, I gave Eileen the, uh, the magic circle or the ring of fire, whatever you want to call it, uh, between her ankles. So uh, enjoy these next two clips. They're a lot of fun. Good. Go ahead. Go. Good. Breathe out. Yeah. And catch. And breathe out and catch. Good. And breathe out. Nice. Keep those feet up. Breathe out. Yeah. All right, Sammy. Woo. Nice, Eileen. Nice. Pull that, those abs in a little tighter. Yeah, just check that lumbar. Make sure it's flat. Good. That's it. Give a little more oomph. Good, that's it. Perfect. Uh, if you haven't done Pilates, um, 
and you want to go to a class, you're going to have a lot of fun with this one. But again, just trust yourself, all right? Learn to trust, learn to feel the coordination, and you're just going to have a ton of fun with that move. All right, these next two clips are, again, of Samantha and Eileen back to pack, doing the same move, a uh, single leg roll down on the reformer. Uh, the carriage is set to a very light spring load, so it requires a lot of power to hold up and uh, con to control the descent. But both of them pull it off like pros, and Samantha has a little bit of fun showing off. So check this out. And go, bring it straight up. Yes, look at that control. That is awesome. All right, roll it down. Keep that leg stable and steady, pointing up to the ceiling. Yep, relax the abs a little bit. Relax the hip just a little bit. Good, yes, keep that foot straight. Roll it down. All right, Sammy, why don't you roll it down nice and slow. Keep the belly in. That's it, keep that belly in nice and straight. Carriage in place. Keep that foot up, keep that foot up, keep that foot up. Fantastic. It's official. A seven-year-old could do it better than some of our other clients. <laughs> oh, oh, now she's showing off. Okay, roll it down. Roll it down, you. Keep that foot in. Keep that foot in. She's better than a lot of trainers now. She's That is fantastic. <laughs> well, that's it for 2017. For those of you who have been following my work, you'll know that this has been my first year back in the health and fitness industry after an extensive and honestly rather depressing hiatus. But this has been an amazing year, and I know that 2018 is going to be even better. You can quote me on that. I'm going to work as hard as I can to provide you guys with more great workout videos, both in and out of the studio, uh, more mentally and emotionally inspiring content with vlogs, interviews, and of course, some more shots at, out in nature. So stick around. And again, I want to thank you for following me uh, so far. And I hope to be able to add as much value to your journey as I possibly can. I also want to thank uh, all my incredible clients for, again, making this so much more than a job, making this so very rewarding. I love everything I do. I love every one of you. And again, I want to just thank you for all your hard work and your dedication. I look forward to helping you through 2018. And of course, a big shout out and thank you to my mentor, Patty. She uh, helped me get started in this whole Pilates journey in the first place many years ago. And she helped me uh, find the right information, make the right contact so I can get back into this again. So again, Patty, I want to thank you. Uh, this has been an incredible year and I really couldn't have done it without you. And of course, the big, big hugs and shout out to Carolina. When she found out I was coming back to the industry, she welcomed me back. No, she dragged me back into her studio with open arms, uh, but I couldn't be happier and uh, more grateful. So thank you very much, darling. I love you. And 2018 is going to kick so much ass. I know it. All right. So again, thank you and loves all around. Now it's your turn to go down into the description. Make sure uh, you hit all the links that you're following, Monster Health and Fitness and Soleil Pilates on all the relevant social media platforms. And if you're watching this on mobile, this is what you gotta do. You gotta scroll all the way down, past all the suggested videos, and uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you liked about this highlight reel, what you didn't, what you wanna see in 2018, what you don't want me to do again, and I will take all of your opinions under advisement and try to apply it going next year. It's gonna be a great year. I know I keep saying that, but it's true. All right, so I'm gonna leave you all off with a piece de resistance, a little clip of Samantha being amazing and showing off. For Monster Health and Fitness and Soleil Pilates, I wanna wish you a happy, healthy, and abundant new year filled with peace, love, and protein pancakes. Take care, everybody. I know you just have to fly the feet up. There you go. There you go. That was better. Much better. Wow, that was awesome.